Okay, this is a quick overview of the fixture. It's basically just a clamshell design. You can see here, the spring goes in and then tighten up these socket head cap screws. And that clamps on the spring and then you can put this in the vise and then preload <clears throat> your spring so you can get it into the trap frame. Um, you'll notice the dowel pins here have notches in them for the legs of the spring to set in on both sides. And those are adjustable down here. Uh, you can loosen this set screw and you can spin these. And what that does is if you're having a problem getting the spring, the main pin to go through the spring and through the trap frame, you can adjust those to make the spring legs kick out more to allow more clearance to get it in the frame, which I'll, I'll show you in a later video. But that's basically all there is to it. Um, it's made out of 6061 aluminum. Um, the socket head cap screws, there are two different lengths. Um, you'll see that there's two shorter ones and two longer ones. Backed out and I'll show you. You can see the uh, shorter ones are on this side, and there's some about eighth inch longer on this side. The shorter ones will go on the side with the dowel pins, and the longer ones will be on this side um, that has nothing to stop them from, you know, going into the lower half. So when you when you put it back on, you always want to make sure that the shorter ones are going over the dowel pins. Um, what you can do is, just for quick reference, you could just get a marker and just put a line there. You know that you need to keep keep them aligned like like that, and that's just a quick reference. So that's just a quick overview of the uh, fixture. Now I'll do a video showing how to remove springs and put new springs back on the traps.